Welcome to Rick Snyder's Washington on YouTube, where you get the whole story. So please like, share, subscribe, comment, and hit the thanks button. Hit that thumbs up button on YouTube, you guys. All right, so three questions on the Washington Commanders. Start right away. Captain Todd, uh, which free agent signing has the biggest impact in this coming season? I looked at four different players on this, including center Tyler Badass, as you know him. Um, you've got Dorrance Armstrong, Bobby Wagner, and Jeremy Chin. I think Tyler's the one that may have the best chance overall as an impact because he can stabilize that offensive line and help everybody down the line. That's what good centers do. Um, Bobby Wagner can make that linebacker core better, maybe the defense better. He has that kind of thing. Jeremy Chin and Armstrong, kind of more of an individual achievers on that level. Uh, but right now, I, I would go with uh, Tyler. Uh, Elijah Quine asked, uh, what makes the most sense for a Washington-San Francisco trade involving uh, Brandon Ayuk. Uh, first off, I don't see that trade happening. It's just an angry player on the eaves of camp, you know, trying to stir the pot and see what can happen. Uh, if a San Francisco does trade him, I mean, Arizona and the Chargers are both going to be hot after that, I think. I don't see uh, Adam Peters really going hard at this. Uh, I think he's a little too conservative on that level. I just don't see it happen. It's a big money play for a receiver. All right, number three, casual sports takes. How does JD5 compare to other rookie quarterbacks that I've covered on this team? Okay, so I go back to Heath and Gus, and, and Heath just, boy, he struggled from the very beginning. I think the best one was, was RG3, at least as far as the off-season camps coming into training camp. RG3 really had it together. But JD5, just a sliver behind, not a lot. He's, he knows this offense pretty well, too. I'm impressed. Um, Jason Campbell was kind of quiet, but did okay. Patrick Ramsey, I'm not even sure we knew he was on the team, and Kirk Cousins was an afterthought back then. I'm Rick Snyder. Thanks for coming. I'll see you soon.